Okay, boy. Idiot. Well, at least it ain't your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. It ain't winning them. I can scrap, Arthur. I'm just not good at homework. I can see. Besides, what do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Ah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please. Yeah? Grow up. And let me come on the raid with you. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? Yeah, my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guard, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. Okay. And what are you? I'm the future, in all its glory. Ah, yeah, well, good luck. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. <clears throat> Wake up, you lazy sir. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. 
And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. Hey, all the horses untethered? Think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. You find a good spot, Wolfman? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. There's a spot that's remote, but should still give them enough. Now look what you've done. Hey, take it easy. You should still give them enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon. Apparently, picks up a new team of guards at the state line, so shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks, and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Ha ha ha. You're a funny fella, John Marston. Come on, folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time, playing sick, and fondling that new scar, like you're going to buy a breakfast in the morning. They're left here, towards Rhodes. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. Boss, I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah. Takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now, in the gunner sea. <laughs> Back in business, boys. <laughs> you know, my dad always used to say... Not the dog, no, please. No, this again. Five! Damn you three! Sulky, angry, scarface. A right barrel of laughs. So, we've got the tracks with the wagon there jumping. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John? Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here. Yeah, yeah. Let's get it on the tracks. Whoa, whoa. Yeah. Mr. Marston? Mr. Smith? Mr. McGuire, come! Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I still would die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. I'm going aboard. Make that quick and join us on there. All right, get hey. on that train. Faster. All yours, Captain. Go on ahead. Everybody stay calm. Sir, you get shot. Conflict. Oh my Go. Dear. Everything you got. Money, valuable. There you go. Let's make this quick, people. Come on. We ain't leaving till this bag's full. No, please. Oh, please. Don't you help me. I ain't I got, got nothing. You want to have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? What's the problem here? Just to conflict, my dear. 
Taking a look yet? There's probably something in here, Arthur. Twice a chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. We're looking good in here. Oh, oh. I'm gonna have a right out lump on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Hosh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. I'm doing me best, all right. I know, that's what's worrying me. These folks are rich, all right. Arthur, we've got a problem. There's two arseholes on horses. How many, you say? I just see a pair of them. All right, in that case, we're fighting. Marston, Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither of you get killed. Goddamn liberties. Eh? There's a few more than torn enough. Damn my big mouth. Okay, let's deal with them. We won't tell you again. Come out now with your hands up. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> that was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. <laughs> Shut up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Hunt there, boy.
Get this off you. You stalking me too, Arthur. You getting crazy, Dutch? Well, I've always been crazy, Arthur. You know that. See. This is a decent pal. Fine, but make sure you get a good price for it. Might as well make some money off it. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. Good morning, Arthur.
Good morning. Wars, stupidity, lies. Who makes this crap up? Why are we having a war with the goddamn Philippines? Who cares about the Philippines? What even are the Philippines? Just the biggest load of nonsense you know. Yeah, it's enough to turn a good, honest fella to drink. Being a bad, dishonest fella, it's gonna send me to drink twice as fast. I just can't go. Oh, hey, George. Really? <laughs> I can't. Molly. Live to see another day. See you, Colin. You're a real woman. Tell us these little bitches. Good to have you back, Carol. Why don't you sit, Arthur? Good morning, Arthur. You okay, Arthur? I guess. He seemed kind of worried. Of course I'm worried. What about? The whole world's changing. 
Even I see that now. Our time is pretty much past. They don't want folk like us no more. This there rules will be damned with you. No more outlaws. No more killers. Now it's us being hunted. Oh, they ain't stopping. We went and made our choices a long time ago, so... I guess we gotta pay for our sins. Oh, Arthur. What a sad world we live in. Well, I ain't sad, Mary Beth. I'm just... I'm realistic about what's coming. I... I can't kill an animal. Needlessly. I don't know. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. You're the only one of these fools knows just how lost he is. Ain't that the truth? <sighs> Ain't that the truth? Look at what we snagged! Dutchie's dog's body! I told you he'd show! All right, boys, let's introduce ourselves! Son of a So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. Come along. You'll see. 
That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. If we try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was the prize pony once. Now I'm the workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well... You was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way... Well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. Post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. I already don't like how this is going. Morning. How you doing? Just about surviving. Gun store? Yep. Can you, uh, head in, pick up a sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Oh, well, hello again. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Shouldn't be a problem. You want to see what we've got? It's all in the catalog here. I'm going to have to take this on credit. Uh, well, no, wait. We ain't even discussed terms. Or I can take it in a way that ain't so polite. Okay, okay, fine. You can uh, pay me later. Couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name, Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. up there. Get a proper view. So I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collected on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. 
Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not until we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. Okay, I think that's them over there. The one now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. Well, looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. He'll get the message. Yep, that spooked him all right. All right, let's go round them up. Okay, boy. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here or there, but not much. Most cowboys I know are dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things, bring them back to the yards. They're pretty scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. Slow it down. Yeah. We got them all. Let's head for town. You know what? Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. Yeah! Back to Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay. Like I said, I'll handle this. There you go. What'd you do that for? Enough with the yap. What are you shooting for? You got some dawdlers, aren't there? Easy now. Move it up. Up, up. Move. Let's 
Now you got it. Those are up, boys. There you go. Fine sheep. They're okay. Well, you seem better around here. I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you. For 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. <laughs> Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying. But we're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Eighteen percent. I thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Thanks for all the help with this. <laughs> can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. You know, it never really was. Look out! Oh. <laughs> Easy! Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a whiskey. Are you coming, then? Not everything, but in the you, end, sir. I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Well, I... Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, Maypo. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen, drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. What the hell? Vandalin! You don't know me, but you keep robbing me! My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you! 
Get out here before I have these men killed. What do you think? Get out here, well, you I... depraved piece of trash. You start spinning the yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. Got where I am by letting Why not? You rob from me? Vandalin, you're done. Now get out here now. Deal with this nonsense. Please. Gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another who wants to be the Messiah? Not me. Do I want to be this Wants to be the Messiah. Not me. Nor do I want to be this Dutch.
retracted the law. Brilliant. That's our horses over there. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, put Strauss on the back of John's. You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure, we can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> May, you think you're so great. Strutting around, nose in the air, holding hands with that dumb. Come on, kid. You care about this girl? Stand up for yourself. She'll come around. Yeah, I've been waiting. Trust me, kid. There ain't so many good men out there. Make yourself one of the good ones. Thanks, mister. I hope you're right. Yeah. Get the horse out of here. Oh, good. Calm down. So, we keep heading east. Is that the plan? For now. And when do we stop? When we reach Paris? 
Oh, that'd be nice. Join the commune. We stop when we find someplace sensible. Shake them that's following us and lie low. This is lying low? It turned into a bunch of killers, I mean it. We ain't even got the delusion of being anything but a bunch of killers. We are just trying to survive, Hosea. We don't have a choice. This will end soon. Damn right it will. Constipated as usual. So, we moving? Yeah. Micah told me of a place we can lie low. Look here. Dewberry Creek, he said. Okay. Maybe you and Charles can go take a look, clear off anyone you find before the whole lot of us move in looking so conspicuous. And how are we gonna do that? I don't know. Start dancing? Looks like I turned into a goddamn errand boy. You have turned into my son. You worry because I worry. We are just the same. Charles, come with me. We got work to do. Now, where have I heard that before? Boy. Whoa. So where are we going? Find a new spot to camp. We're packing up and moving on. Again? We have to. Fast. We don't... Eddie pushed our luck too far before that mess we just made in Valley. Ah, uh, that didn't sound good. Killed a lot of law. Killed a lot of Cornwall's men. They must know where we are by now. So, we're heading south? Yeah. Area called Dewberry Creek. Dutch wants us to give it a look. Make sure it's clear and a good place to lie low for a while. I've only known him a few months, but the way he talks, I never thought I'd see him wanting to head south. Right. And I know by now, there ain't no lying low. There's too many of us for that. And there ain't no way Dutch is gonna just hide away in a cave somewhere. Goes against everything he stands for. That'd be admitting we're nothing more than low-down criminals. Which we are. You don't have to tell me. So where does it end? Where does what end? The moving, the running. The Dutch don't see it as running. Call it what you want. I don't know. Before, put enough time and distance between you and the problem, eventually it went away. I mean, this is a big country. But now, with these Pinkertons. Now, hang on a second. I think that must be it up ahead, the old dried up creek. Seems very open. Yeah, it does. Ain't sure to be the best in the rain, neither. Well, let's take a look around. Hey, I see something over there. You see it? Someone on the ground there. He's been shot. Looks like trouble got here before us. Hmm. There's a camp just up ahead. Sure. Let's get ready for business. Any issues? Shoot first, debate second. I'm not gonna shoot for the sake of it. All right, Charles, let's go take a look. Look, here it is. A few tents, but place looks empty. Let's have a look around and make sure. Where is everybody? 
Maybe they heard us coming. Be careful. I'm being careful. Someone's been here. Sure. Someone's still here. There ain't no one here now. I ain't so sure about that. It's okay. It's okay. Come out of there. You okay? I don't mean no harm. He said, are you okay? Sprechen Sie Deutsch? German? No. Now go on, get out of here. Go, we need the land, go. Get the hell out of they here. They took our father. Who did? M men, last night. Where? Where did they take him? It ain't no business of ours. I don't even speak their language. You ain't as tough and dense as all that. Come on, Arthur. The girl was pointing this way. Let's see if we can pick up a trail. There. Tracks. Come on. I don't see nothing. Hoof marks. This way. What's going on with you? What do you mean? You were just gonna send that woman and her children on their way? We're wanted, man. We got Pinkertons braiding down our necks. We should be moving camp, not running off on some wild goose chase. Come on, Arthur. That's not how you are. Well, maybe you don't know me as well as you think you do. Hold up. Let me check this. Looks like they go down this way. So, what happened with those Pinkertons anyway? When you were fishing with Jack? Said they were on to us. Offered me freedom if I turned Dutch here. <laughs> they picked the wrong man there. We should have moved right then, if you ask me. Wait a second, just want to look closer here. along the shore here. Now, I was saying, bastards told me they'd killed Mac. Said it right in front of Jack. Ah, that kid, it's gonna be tough for him. Yeah, but he has more folk looking out for him than most of the rest of us had growing up. John said he was going back to the auction yard to collect the money for those sheep. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he reckoned he'd be able to slip in and out. Oh, well. If it's John's idea, it must be a good one. What is it with you and him? Uh, he disappeared on us for a while. But Jack was real young. A long while. Here. Yeah. Wait, just let me make sure this is right. They carry on along this trail. So, you were saying? 
<laughs> you did? And we was family, you know? I guess I still ain't fully forgiven him for that. There's a cap up ahead. Be careful. Seems deserted. Let's take a look. Where is this guy? I don't know. But you know something? This is a better camp spot than back there. Much easier to defend. Maybe. This looks like our feather, Charles. Quick, cut him free and let's get out of here. I see three coming this way. You get the hell away from here. What are we doing? This ain't even our goddamn fight. them dealt with. You get them untied, and I'll see what they've left behind for us. I thought you wanted to get this over with, Arthur. Schneiden Sie das Seil durch, bitte! Cut him free. Let's get him back to his family. Bitte, lass es mich gehen. Hier drüben. Come on, he looks in some pain there. Okay, we're getting you out of here. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Yeah, okay. Hey, you wait there a second. Charles, go find Dutch. Get the caravan to divert here. This spot should work for us. I agree. Take you back to your family. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Also soll ich mitkommen? It's okay. We're getting you out of here. I just...
Wo bringen Sie mich hin? What the hell did you do to those fellers? Wie bitte? Those men back there, why did they take you? Geld, money. Meiner Familie gehört eine Goldmine. Sie wollen Lösegeld erpressen. How did someone even come up with them words? Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Uh, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. Yeah. Dem Herrgott sei Dank! Schatz! Oh. Andreas! Oh. Andreas! Ich hab gedacht, du seist tot! Beinahe wärst du gewesen, meine Lieblinge, meine Herz allerliebst! Oh, wie wunderbar! Oh. Sie sind ein großer Mann! Ja! Ein großer Mann! Ja, wirklich! Es ist ein Segen, dass Thanks. wir sie getroffen haben! Come on, now get out of here, this place ain't safe! Get out of here! Ja, ja, alles klar. Vamos. Uh, ich hab was für Sie. Einen Moment. Uh, um, Dankeschön. Thank you. Vielen Dank, herzlichen Dank. Guess it was a pleasure. Ja! You were right. Oh, this place. Oh, it'll be perfect for us. Hello, Arthur. Dutch. <clears throat> Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, put everyone to work. Make this place a home. Well, I don't know where the hell we are, but we are going to make the best of it. Thank mm -hmm. you.